for a story of all things. Truly, this is where I was meant for. But, oh God. Sorry, I forgot I was waiting for the fucking game to load. What scene is this? Is this the one where she gets captured like for the 87th time? Or where she gets captured for the 74th time? I, I lost track. Oh! Okay, so 87th it is. So yeah, I, you know, it's it's kind of like going to the one place he expected to... Never mind, I think I made that joke before. Doesn't even matter, does it? Doesn't she have guards or, like, somebody... Never mind, it's it's not worth it. It's, it, it's not worth it. It's just not worth it. Methylis. Methylis. Tell me, tell me, who is the Iblis Trigger? Is the well, Iblis if you Why had been listening to my maximum world? edge factor, I'd already world? explain this. Why does that matter to you? Allow me to be as suspicious as humanly possible. Unless you complete your task, Unless your future will task, remain the same. Will remain the same. Forever. <laughs> <laughs> He's currently at the terminal station. It's now or never if you want it's this. I could easily do this myself, but I would prefer not to, because... Reasons. <sighs> Radical train! It's exciting. I really want to do Radical fucking train tonight. Yeah, so I, I was serious. I was like, I was like, I, I, I just felt like I, I just didn't want to make any commentary, and then they're like, uh, Why can't I get into the station? You can just walk. Is there a way to do this without being noticed? I mean, I could pick them up and just like force choke them, but that would be too cool for Silver. So logically, well, it's time for guards to go on rounds. Oh yeah, isn't there a fucking stealth mission involved here? Who do I talk to to activate that? Hey! 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 Do I do I gotta talk to that guy? Girl? No! Shit! Oh, shit, no! Ain't nobody got time for that. Oops, sorry. Uh. It's. Okay, how about. Oh, the store? Uh, okay, so I have to go buy something first. I don't know what. But the game apparently insists that I do this. So, whatever. I guess I'll do that. There we go. Um. Well, I don't know what it wants me to buy specifically. Uh, did I already? Okay, there we go. And then I'll buy the shock bracelet. And admittedly, the shock bracelet is... Okay, there. I bought everything. I don't know how to fucking do the one thing. That's not really that useful. The shock brace is nice, actually. The shock brace lets me do this. Which, admittedly, is kinda helpful. Kinda. Just kinda. Anyway, back to what I was doing, which was trying to figure out... Like... I think it's the stealth mission where you just gotta sneak past the stupid guards, but I don't know how to make it, like, happen. Oh. I walk away and come back. Of course. What else would it be? So I'm annoyed because my root beer, um, 
got frozen because my refrigerator is apparently too cold. So now I'm like slowly sipping it as it melts, and it's really, really frustrating because I want to drink it now, and I can't. Uh, so, you know, whatever. <sighs> it's a good thing they set up all these, like, you know, really, really... Oh, shit, 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 shit. Wow, uh... Okay, that was, a. Uh... Maybe, maybe they can't protect the least because they're actually clinically blind. Um, if that were the, the actual reason, I would at least understand. Perfect. Perfect. Uh, yeah. Why can't it... You know, if... Okay. Here's a thought. There's so, they have so many like load screen issues in this game. You have any idea how many load screen issues would be gone if they just cut the world map out? I mean, the game would be like half as long without the world map, but it would probably be actually a bit better if there were no world map to worry about because there would be less load times and the game would at least at least it would be over quick. You know, if it were just the levels in order, it might not be as horrific as you know, it, it still wouldn't be very good, but it wouldn't be. You know, yeah. You, you, you know what I mean? Does that make sense? I'm not going to let the English trigger get away. You <sighs> were just discussing whether or not this was a good idea, and yet here we are again. Okay. And here's where like physics puzzles get like su they get super hardcore about Silver's physics puzzles in this stage. Ah, to the point, ow. To the point that I actually have to think about what I'm doing. And by think I mean, oh god, have some patience with what I'm doing. Not really so much think about it, just, you know. Acknowledge that I have to do something that requires me paying attention to the game. Or I could just, like, run down the middle. Also an option. Or, uh, I think they are slowly moving down. Okay, so maybe I need like one weight. Sorry, game. Apparently, this skill's a bit more. Yeah, just just the one. Uh, of course, it needs to stay on the weight. Thank you, friend. God, fuck. Can we? Yeah. There we go. That'll work. It's a good thing they can really aim those shots, otherwise I might be in trouble. Oh, 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 shit! Fuck. God damn it. And no, I'm not worried about that metal. Fuck that. Nobody got time for that. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Oh, jeez! Oh, you got to be kidding me! Fuck off! That is such shit! Ugh. You might, at the rate you're going. I mean, you just started the level, you already fell in a fucking hole. Like a super genius. Fucker. Ah. Uh. Also, he says the conveyor belt changes direction, and it doesn't. So, I don't know why he even says that. I'm aware that it does it in Sonic, and I think Shadow Stage, you know, version of the stage, but not not Silver's, apparently. So, you know, Silver just couldn't handle that, and... God fucking get, I just put... You know... It really isn't challenging when I'm fighting, like, the fact that these steel crates are, like, like, fucking Super Bowls, and just bounce all over the place, you know? Like... Oh my fucking god. This one fucking... Scale is actually 
giving more of a challenge than like anything else so far. And I don't know why. Like I've gotten past it before, obviously. Ugh. Okay. Jesus Christ. There's a one up in there. I really don't care about that. I guess I go this way. Do I go over there? I mean, I can go over there. I don't know if I'm supposed to, but I can do it. Go fuck the level. Like, I don't care where they wanted me to go. This is where I'm going. Yeah, that's what I was trying to do when you... Seriously? Can, can we... Can... Can the fucker not break down wooden... They're wooden boards, Silver! This really is not that hard! Throw the fucking robot at it. I don't care. There you go! Fuck! How hard was that? Ugh! Now, Silver would be in big trouble if there weren't, a, like, a bunch of random boxes lying around all the time for him. Like, what would he throw? Like, how would he do anything without his boxes? Uh, okay. I wasn't sure if I was going to make that. I was fairly alarmed for a moment. Well, maybe you're just not trying hard enough. Do you ever think about that? No. You only think about yourself and your stupid future that you're here to save, you jackass. Actually, I, I turned to look at the chat and get hit immediately in the face. That's always nice. Oh god, there's a fucking trains. How does Silver ever catch up to Sonic or Shadow? He's like slow as fuck. He, like, I mean, maybe it makes sense since like he has to fight like an entire like Sonic and also he can't grind apparently. I I didn't even realize that Silver doesn't know how to grind. Man, there's a lot of like diesel engines just just driving down in a row on this one track, and I uh, don't think tra there's not even anything on the trains. Like you just transporting empty cars and now this how long does this train go it is it's just gonna keep going isn't it I bet it is oh no it does end it does okay great I, I, I was curious to see whether that train was like infinite or something never end a train, a train. Oh, 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 oh no but it ended so you know Can I... Can we just... Please... Why does everything about you have to be annoying, Silver? You, you know... I know you didn't ask to be born, but... Really... Come on now. Oh my god. Seriously? It's just a fucking... Ugh! God damn it. Oh, thank God that's over. That was awful. That was easy. It really wasn't. And you're a da you're an asshole. There we go. I knew it. I knew oh, I knew you'd return. I knew you had return. to. From the future? You again. You again. This time there will be no more interruptions. I am here to save the future. Sorry. Sorry. 
It's no use! I don't know why there's an echo. I'll see about turning this down. Time for you to disappear! Maybe that'll help. You think you might be able to tell us apart given the fact that I, A, have a mouth, B, am clearly red and black, where he is some, like, weird green and black, but, you know, uh, you're obviously a fucking idiot, so I don't know why I'm asking these questions. Also, maximum edge factor. I won't hold back. I won't Here hold I come. back. Here I come. I was about to make a really, really dirty joke, but I won't. I <laughs> when you in bed about to nut. Okay, sorry. <laughs> oh, okay. I cracked myself up. Nobody else is going to think that's funny but me, but it's worth it, worth it, worth it really. God damn it. Okay, Shadow is actually kind of a pain. God damn it. Because I can't just, like, shuck stuff at him. I mean, I can't. I, I do that, but I have to actually think about it. Because he actually... First of all, there's less stuff. There's just these barrels. Second of all, he can actually, like, dodge. Which is super annoying. And he has invincibility frames. I don't know why he has them and Sonic doesn't. But he does. So this is slightly more tedious. Do, 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 There you go. Take that. Take that. Seriously, we'll be here all day like this, this raid. Ah. <sighs> <sighs> Take this! Oh, whatever. I don't know. Something kind of edgy. I think I still got an S rank. Yeah, I did. Perfect! Perfect! Ugh. Gross. Do 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 He's just tried to punch him in the face. Like, you won the fight. I don't know how, why this ends up the same. Now cut yourself on my edge. How did Silver A know he could do that? B no, never mind. Again, it's not worth it. I mean, these days everybody seems to be doing it, so I'm not sure why I'm even questioning it anymore. And I don't know why he doesn't just do it himself. I mean, what a lazy prick. Ow! 
Actually, there's basically no purpose to us going back and seeing what happened ten years ago. Unless you mean creating a time paradox, in which case there's a complete purpose to us going back to ten years ago. So is that like... I think I made this joke before, but it's like, they're like, they're like a level select screen inside the, all the time portals that go in. So I can just choose where to go. You know, when your techno babble puts Star Trek to shame, I just feel like you may need better writers. Well, electrocuting him probably isn't the best way to go about that. You know, if it was going to explode, you might want to have run sooner. It could, uh, could be any fire. You don't know. You know his... You, <laughs> you know his fire, not his story. Oh, just because he's black, it must be evil Mephilus. Fucking racist. Anyway... I just happen to have this lying around for just such an occasion. Also, I pulled that out of my ass, by the way. You may want to wipe that off. It's a little sticky. It's a good thing I'm not doing this whole, like, take a drink in between for load screens, like... If this were actual alcohol, it's root beer. Because uh, I get so fucking wasted for these load screens. Uh, like Sonic 06 drinking game. Take a you know, drink every time there's a load screen. It will literally kill you. Um, so, don't ever play that. Word to the wise. Pro tip from Darkness the Curse. Seriously, are, are we... Can... There we go. Ah, good, I run straight into Shadow. Well, you're, well, you're gonna lead me all the way back here. Thank God, you're so insufferable. Da-da, 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 da-da. You ever wonder if Shadow, like, runs around at the speed of sound, but, like, sings to himself while he does it? I'll be just fine, pretending I'm not. I'm far from lonely, and it's all that I got. Let's see what else. What else? What else could he be singing? Um, crawling in my skin, these wounds they will not heal. I, 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 I gotta go one. I gotta go one. And this is a joke that literally only one other person who's watching right now will get. But, um, I'm gonna make it anyway. So break my legs and split me to pieces! <laughs> Scream out so no one can hear it! So you can look into the days gone by! Something like that, I forgot how that song goes. I haven't heard it enough. So emo. Anyway, uh... Uh, what else could he sing? Uh, what would Silver sing? I don't know. Probably something lame. I prefer making fun of Shadow singing. Also, I like how that Shadow singing was like like, like th 30 seconds long. Like, what did I really do? I ran around in a room and smacked people. And then I was done. Like, we're done playing a Shadow now. Back to Silver. Sorry. Uh... <laughs> I 
I mean, the chat's making fun of the fact that he's definitely singing his own theme song. You know, you know that's okay. I'm okay with that, because I can see Silver being such a fucking pleb that he would actually be running around singing his own fucking theme song. That is something he would totally do. And I am okay with that, I, with that thought in my mind. Alright, so, I, I, I gotta point this out. So, this beam, clearly they set this up so that you had to go all the way around this beam to get to the switch to turn the, you know, open the door over there, right? You can walk around it! I didn't even notice this, but... The fuck kind of... <sighs> Guys, I, I just... You know, I'll ask, I, I really, uh, I mean, on one hand, yeah, the level's way easier now, and I really didn't want to have to go around like that, but given the fact that's what they wanted me to do, you'd think they would have taken the time to actually, you know, make sure that's what, you know, was going to happen. Ridiculous. Ridiculous. I'm actually annoyed by that. I'm actually, like frustrated at the thought that they were that fucking inept that they couldn't even fix like that basic kind of level design flaw like you played a level one time and you should notice that uh, you know i guess i can't say that because i'm only just now noticing it before i would just jump over the beam which you can also do um which is also a thing you should notice playing one time through uh, you know either way there were several flaws there. I was about to jump over it when I realized I could walk around it, which is even funnier. Alright. Where do I go now? I grab an extra life. So why wouldn't I? And, uh... Do I just jump down? I feel like I was already in this room, but the problem is they rehashed, like, the level design so many fucking times in this game, it's kind of hard to tell. I, I, I almost had to have been, uh, just because, well, then I went around, yeah, now this, okay, now, okay, so I guess I went around to open this door specifically, so I went around in a big fucking circle, which is always nice, but, you know, whatever. Oh! <laughs> okay, that was a great game, thanks for that, I appreciate it. It was so nice of you. Well, yeah, if, the, if there was an invisible wall there, I would get mad. But, like, if there was a physical wall there, I wouldn't. At least that would make sense. You know. I never asked them to put an invisible wall anywhere. I asked them to put an actual wall where they wanted an actual wall to be. You know? I asked them to try. And God... F Why am I even doing this? Because there's no reason for me to do that. And I keep forgetting... That, there, that there's no reason to because, again, bad design. to tell you, Edgy. Funky Lizard is awesome, and presumably funky. Anyway. Yeah, so, uh, speaking of exploits. Admittedly, this exploit requires... I would almost call this an exploit, and at least this requires some a certain level of skill to accomplish... So, you know, I can't get too mad at them about this. Also, the puzzle they want me to do here is super irritating anyway, so again, I don't really want to do it. So I'm glad this is something, an option. Like, this is almost, like, this is a flaw that I would say, I'm okay they left in it, because, like, I, like, if I were the game designer, I would see this and actually think to leave it in, just to give the player a different option. If my puzzle were, of course, that fucking irritating. Uh, which it is, so, you know, yeah. Typical things to worry about. Alright, so there's a giant fucking worm here. Okay, we're just gonna kill those things and be done. There's lasers. It's a good thing I could really see those lasers well, and they weren't just, you know, thrown all over the place. Yeah, that, uh, that's usually, you know... Advice to live by. Fortunately, these random floating orbs are really, you know, nice for throwing at enemies. Now, why this secret laboratory has random floating orbs, I don't fully understand. Um, I don't expect there to be any explanation, given I've never gotten one in the... God, it's been... It's 
It's been 11 years, hasn't it? Almost 11 years since this game came out. Y'all realize that? Jesus Christ. I don't know how I can handle that anymore. It did, did the game freeze? Uh, oh! Oh! Oh, the game froze! I'm about to flip out, yo! Uh, Continue, shall we? Ugh. Again, don't know what the floating orbs are for. I mean, I guess this whole time I could be question I've questioned the boxes, which I was admittedly in the last level, saying so pointing those out. Um, also, can one of these enemies die? Cause, like, seriously, uh. <laughs> Okay. Uh, different, different thought. Yeah, that's that's much better. There we go. Okay, I can't just stun him, unfortunately. There, now I can. Health has to be a certain amount, and then I just like you know throw him. There we go, all done. Jump over that. Jump over that! Checkpoint! This one's way easier than the last one, so I'm just gonna do it. I think. Unless oh, God! I didn't know the... I'm glad the giant ones pop like the little ones don't. You know? Am I the first one to point that out? I feel like I'm not. Radical! You're not Devil May Cry, alright? And you never will be. Well, given the fact that there's water out there, I'm gonna vote a yes on that whole underwater thing. How do humans get around in this laboratory? Has anyone ever thought of that? Like, how, how does anyone, like, move? Like, Silver literally gets through this with the benefit of being able to literally fly. And, uh, I feel like, you know, most people wouldn't be able to do that. Like, Sonic can, like, homing attack, which is kind of like flying, and so can Shadow. Silver can literally fly, but like who else would be able to get through here? Like how do the humans do it? This is a human base, you know? <sighs> okay, they're gone. All done. Thank you. Nice to be standing on a laser. That's a thing you can do. Stand on a laser. It's a hard light hologram, presumably. That's the logical explanation for that. And we're going with it. That's what you're going to deal with. That's what we're going to accept. And you're not going to question me, goddammit. Fucking fight me. Ah! Can... There we go. Okay. Door open. I think. No. What did I miss? Do I need to kill all of them? God damn it, that's annoying. Fuck you! Okay. Oh, the, the ring just magically appears now that all the enemies are gone. Okay, whatever.
Looks like I am here to save the future! Or something, presumably. I don't know. I don't know. I don't even guess anymore. He's here to do something. I hope. Maybe. <sighs> That's what he sounds like. Sounds like he's having trouble going to the bathroom. What are you saying? You listen here, you whippersnapper! I'm an old man! And I am here to save the future. No, that's what I... No, listen to me. I'm going to save the future by sealing the flames of an angry god inside my, my five-year-old daughter. Uh, I don't think that's a really good idea. No, it's a brilliant idea. I'm an old man. Hey, why is there... <laughs> why is there... <laughs> no, seriously, why is there... <laughs> a fucking phone dial on that guy's chest? Do y'all notice that? Hopefully it'll show it again real quick. Oh, quick! Quick! Quick, young one! Dial me! What? Dial me! You want me to dial 911? No! Dial me! First, you have to dial me! 8675309! Um, is that a song? Just dial it! If you cry even once, you will literally destroy the planet! But it's okay! I'm certain you, seven-year-old girl, can handle it. Dial me! WHAT AM I FIGHTING FOR?! The future. Did you do it? Yes. Did you do it? Did you yes, I did it. I also did it. We both did it. Yeah. Together. <laughs> it's not done. You know they get released again. You literally know that. In fact, now that you know where the flames are sealed, the logical thing he could do, considering he was already on a homicidal rampage anyway, is to actually kill her, which I know sounds heartless, but if you think about it, it makes the most sense given what his mission is. And I wanted to create a random fetch quest for myself to kill some game time. Kirajima donated something, but thank you for whatever you did. That's awesome, friend. Appreciate that. Fourteen ninety-eight. Why a random number like that? Thank you, though. I appreciate it. I could like pay half a bill with that or some shit. <laughs> Thank you, seriously. No, don't do it. 
No! You're dumb! Why would you... Why would you do it? Why would you do that? You could just stab her. You know. It's, a lucky charm. it's not a lucky charm! She has... She has an angry god inside her, and you're giving her one of the most powerful sources of energy in the fucking universe as a lucky charm. You were there for most of this! You... You literally know what happens!